put the barrels as far out as possible. So, like, kill them outside. But, um, besides, like, what else did I, like, steal, bro? Like, we're using completely different builds. If you're gonna really say that using two barrels, putting two barrels in a spawn is, like, your strategy. Like, I was doing this, <clears throat> I was doing this with Samurai, like, four months ago before I left. And it was the same shit. Like, I'd put barrels in the points. That's just what you have to do, bro. That's just, like, the logical thing to do if you're going for something like this. Like, I don't think you can really trademark that as your own and then call me out as, like, a, a thief for using that. Yeah, bro. I mean, the thing is... I don't get it. Like, I, I, try to, I, I try to give up, like... Not, not give up. Like, I, 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 he's messaging me right now, by the way. But I, I try to give him perspective and, like... Because he asked me my thoughts, and I, I, I gave him my genuine thoughts. Like, I said, like... Oh, gosh, he's still going. <laughs> um, I told him, like, I'm happy that you got it, first of all. And then I told him, like, I was surprised because I didn't know you were grinding for it. Um, and in the grand scheme of things, like, like, I, I, I heard his video too, so I'm a bit confused as, to, as, as opposed to, like, like, when he said, he, spe he said specifically in the video, like, like, that you had a different change up. Like, you, you decided to use Weightless Spirit and Sticky over, like, Poison, Kunai. Yeah. Yeah, so, like. Can you just invite him to this party, bro? Sure. Um, I don't know if he's gonna join though. Let me ask him first. I, I don't want him to feel like I guess uncomfortable. I guess like I I don't want. Uh, let me ask him real quick. Cause I feel like he should have at least talked to you first before like putting out a whole video, you know? No, he didn't say anything. Oh, he just said, hold on, uh, bro, I'm reading it right now, he says, he says right here, I have no intention of talking with KFN as he felt he didn't need to do the same when he, when he copied my work. I had hoped that you wouldn't have acknowledged that he swept me under the rug, but was disappointed to see you didn't call him out on that. I don't, I don't know if you did behind the scenes, so I cannot say. Similar to you, I'm happy he was able to complete the run. I'm not happy with the lack of transparency and holding of each other's accountability as I considered you and him as peers and people I looked up to. I can understand the position you are in, as this ultimately had nothing to do with you. Your friend is your friend, and I personally wouldn't be friends with people that are so quick to stab me in the back. 
again, my experience isn't reflective of your. Nevertheless, I wish you all the best. You're a very nice guy, and I have had a good time getting to know you and the place and goes with each other. What do you think, bro? I don't know, bro. I don't think he's gonna hop on if I were to invite him, but like... He's not, he's not. It's fine. But like, uh, what are your thoughts, like, just honestly? If you think, like, um, I, I mean, I probably should have, like, given him credit just for that one strategy, like, the the barrels, like, mm -hmm. on 13 and 14. But, but that, like, besides that, I don't see what else I did, bro. Bro, like, because the thing is, like, the way I see it is, like, strats and builds, co co they're, they're cohesive with each other, bro, like. Um, yeah. The gameplay was completely different, like, you're playing, you're playing towards, like, Blowgun and Kunai and, and all this. Yeah, Blowgun, Kunai, and then, like, also Poison, Poison Vanish. Those are the, those are, like, the, that's part of the strat. The build is part of the strat, number one. Mm -hmm. Number two, um, you obviously ran a different one. You know, like you had Weightless Spirit and Sticky Palm. Like, and I, I mean, for the record, like when I when he said like he sent me the links to his videos, like I, I kid you not, bro. Like there were times I didn't watch some of it at all. Yeah, bro. Obviously, you're not gonna watch all of it. Yeah, because it's, it's, it's long. It's very long. I have yeah. school. I have school. I have I. Bro, I, I was close to my finals week, which just passed, <laughs> so I don't have time to watch everything, and, like, not let it, that alone, is, I don't have time to grind, like, the, this this run at all. So I, I have nothing to do with... Is he insinuating that, like, you would send me the links, and then I would watch them and just, like, copy what he does? Is that what, like, he's I trying think, to say? I think that's what he's trying to say. Like, but Okay, the well, obviously, is, that's I, complete I shit. Said, any of the links to anybody i know i know I, I, but that's I probably what he thought bro I, I i i have like the thing is bro dread is a good player first and foremost right we, we can all agree that he's he's an amazing player mm -hmm. he, he, he he's he's accomplished like crazy things that i wish i got to accomplish with him like um i was grinding it out with him uh twilight and ashes no hit you know and I was hoping that we would get it. It was kind of a bit, like, a t it took a toll on, on a lot of my time. Like, there were, like, the times that I was running with him, I wanted to set up the, I wanted to set up the tournament earlier on. But I was I actually really wanted to get that run before setting up the next tournament. So, like, mm -hmm. I, I wasn't that transparent with him on that, on that part. Like, I was, I was kind of hoping, like, I, I could have done a tournament during the Christmas time. But I never got around to doing it because, like, I was grinding that stuff out with Dread, you know, the, the no hit Twilight yeah. and Ashes Helmo duo. But I never, I never got it. You know, sadly, I, I didn't get. But he, he eventually got it with somebody else, and you know, kudos to him for that. I was kind of bummed that he got it with somebody else. Yeah, but you're not gonna go out and put a whole video on. Uh, yeah, like, and know. that's that's fine. You know, like I'm happy that he got he. That's a that's an that's an amazing feat for him. You know, like I'm, I'm yeah. happy that he did that. And yeah, yeah, and the thing is, like, he he's he's expressed like you know, congra congratulatory remarks to both of us on our end, and I guess like, I guess to make it fair, like, uh, for for my side of the story at least, you know, like, like, I commented that on your video, on on your win, like literally when we were in a party together, you know, like we were just kind of <laughs> chilling, we were just kind of kicking back, you know, just playing games with the, the demon homies and you know I, I I know like I I already knew like Dread was grinding for it and like the thing is like 
I, I, I don't know how to say it, bro. Like, I, I guess my thoughts is like, the, the thing is, my, I guess my reaction to like dread, like I sympathize for like, I, like, like his, for his feelings for the most part. Yeah. Yeah. I, like, yeah, I bro. Yeah. We, we, we both. But at the end, I know, bro, like you don't like, even when I was writing this down, like when you, when we were going for like hell mode, perfect solo, like for the first one, bro, like I, I think a couple days before you got yours, I got literally to like wave 15 mm -hmm. and I just, I just lost the zone or whatever. Mm -hmm. And then I see you get it right after, obviously like it hurt. Because I was like, fuck, bro, so close. But then that doesn't mean that, like, you know, there's any animosity towards that. Yeah. Because, like, we're, like, I don't I don't know. Like, nobody owns, he was saying, like, in the, in his video that, oh, this was, like, my project. Like, I, you can't, like, I don't know. You don't own, like, an assassin now mode perfect solo. Like, there's no copyrights to that shit, you know? Yeah. If somebody and... else can get it, then they deserve it. Yeah, the thing is, like, I don't know how to I don't know how to put it, bro. But all I know is, <sighs> sorry, I kind of brain farted, bro. My bad. Like, so good. Uh, oh no, no, I remember what I was gonna say now. Like, like, bro, I've I I think I told Dread in one of my messages too. I told him like, I I had to live with <laughs> a fun nightmare, taking my record over and over again. <laughs> And of course, I, I was kind of like bummed and upset about it too. Like that, oh man, there's someone faster than me. But I, I've I've learned to live with it, type of thing. You know, like the thing is, it's true. You, you can't necessarily claim a project. Like, like I wouldn't say like, even though yeah, I did get Hell Mode Perfect Solo. I, I have like the first one, and I guess possibly the most in the community. Like I have 13 now or whatever. Yeah. Like that's that's my own like personal accomplishments, and like I, I can brag to say that, and I have the proof to you know put it out there or whatever. But I, I, I guess like like we we have like our own things that are kind of like one upped on each other. Like the one thing I can't do to get over you, like for the past like years I've been playing, I can't, I'm not as fast as you, bro. Like I I like. I've, I've I've lived with it and I'm okay with it, but of course I still want to get world record, you know, in my competitive. Obviously, yeah. You know, yeah. I I want it, I, I I still want it. But the thing is, like, I'm still happy that you're you're still the record holder for both Helmo Perfect Solo and Nightmare Survival. You're, you're the record holder, you know, and like, I'm jealous, but like, bro, you deserve it because you put in the time and you put in the work, you know, and like, I don't claim the projects. I don't claim it, you know. I mean, you can't claim the project, bro. That's yeah, just not I, I don't it claim is. it. That's that's the thing, you know. Like I, I I know I do it a lot, but perfect solo is up for grabs for anyone, and that's the point. You yeah. Know? And like I understand, like I, I I guess I guess I want I want clarity on one thing, uh, Knight. Is uh, did you um, how do I say this? Did, did you come up with the strat or did you did you did you do the barrel strat after you'd spoken with dread or did you already were you already doing that is, is what i'm kind of curious about which like specifically putting barrels at the back um or just putting barrels in general like waiting for them to respond putting, putting like come on man like i was doing this in freaking um nightmare survival perfect solos with the Ronin, remember? I'd literally put four barrels oh, yeah. on a point. You're Bro, right. Like, this is such a logical, intuitive thing. Like, you can't claim that as your own. That's like saying, like, oh, I came up with the strat to mm -hmm. smoke and get six headshots and, and ultimate. Like, there's just, it's like, mm -hmm. when something is so intuitive and logical to the point, like, and by the, I was doing this, uh, what's it called? Um... Like, I was going for Helmut Perfect Solo with Samurai a couple months ago, before I left. And I was doing the same thing. Same build, same strategy. I, like, barrels in the point. Because there's no other way to do it. Mm. Like, I, I don't see how you can claim that. The only thing, and, like, I'll take accountability for it, 
was when you said to <laughs> when you said to like put barrels in the front and barrels in the back. But I mean, obviously, you're gonna want to put barrels in the front because it's the outside objective. Right. It'd be kind of stupid to put them in the center because by that point they're in the circle and you're not getting the objective. Right. And the but thing and is, he's, he's saying I stole everything. Like if I use the same exact build and like you know copied his like gameplay and everything like that okay you might have a point but even that like it's still like it's more like, intuitive um, for like to kind of get that kind of clear like I, I know exactly what you're talking about because you did that on Alan. yeah but even like bro throughout like playing this game i'm putting out like whatever my runs my solos builds and and stuff like that i'm sharing it with the community and i've always like had this um philosophy is that if somebody uses the same things as me like and they do better or they achieve something that i can't then that's just i just gotta respect it because even though maybe if they even used like what what i started using first it doesn't matter because they still earned it man exactly bro that's, that's, know? that's exactly how i feel about like your world record runs bro like I can try to match you or be faster than you, but bro, like... And if you do, like, you, you copy my builds, like, with the, my controls, whatever, if you do... Bro, more power to you, man. You freaking earned it, bro. Like, yeah, that's it. Yeah, exactly. That, that, that's how I see it, too. But uh, the one thing I just can't really wrap my head around... I, uh, the one thing I... When I was watching Dredd's video, I, I, I kind of, like, made, I made a side comment as he was, like, talking about... Talking through it all. I think he's kind of taking things out of proportion bro and if he doesn't want to dialogue that's on him bro he, we were giving him this opportunity right now and nightmare for the record bro i hope you don't mind but bro i've been recording our conversation and, and like no no go ahead and, and right. the thing is bro like i think people need to at least hear both sides of the story you know like i i, I yeah. right now i i'm i'm willing to dialogue with dread about it but if he's like if he's if he's just gonna close that door and shut us off completely then that's just on him and he, i feel like like i don't know bro like like bro even when so before for your solos you were always using double o damage mm -hmm. and then you saw me i was using oni damage and then you switched didn't you because you saw like um Sometimes I was getting faster than you or whatever, mm -hmm. and then you you switched over. You say, okay, yeah, like, yeah, I like this build better. Yeah, and I yeah. That doesn't. Like, I'm not gonna go after you and say, yo, you stole my build, bro. Exactly, and the thing and is, and then you're like, starting to get faster times, and I get mad at you because you you beat my time or whatever. The thing is, like the way I see it, bro, it's like we're, we're sharing ideas to better each other. That's how I always saw it. Yeah, and like that's what I've always done. Yeah, like I I've always seen it that way, and I I. Like, literally, bro, all power to you for, like, being so fast, bro. Like, I feel like if we were to run in a race, like, the, the analogy I'm about to give, bro, it's, it's like, if we were to run in a race, bro, like, I probably have, like, won a lot, but, like, if we were to race against each other, you would always be faster than me. You know what I mean? Like, that's just how, that's just kind of how I always saw things in terms of, like, the perfect solo game aspect to legends bro you know and yeah and I, I i have like huge amounts of respect to you and i'm pretty sure you have that towards me too you know of course. I, and the reason why i say like dread is taking it out of proportion is i think he just he just kind of is you know like because he, he was grinding for it for a very long time and you know like grinding bro like i would see this guy on like almost all day i know I, so yeah like he was really trying to get it and that's why like when i got it i did kind of feel bad mm. <laughs> but um like i don't know nobody like owns projects for this yeah i don't for this game i guess like yeah I guess, well, we can, I guess, gauge with this conversation, like, I don't own Perfect, I, I don't, I don't own the, the label Perfect Solo, yeah, I'm like the Perfect Solo guy, you know, I do it like every week, or whatever, right, but, like, it's not like, I guess, my own project, I guess, per se, you know, like, 
I'm, I'm not claiming perfect solo as the, the Joey thing. I mean, of course people will recognize me for it. And you know, yeah. when that, when those two words come together, maybe, maybe not, maybe people have never heard of me and people have seen other people perfect solo without Joey Dominguez as the label, you know, and that's totally fine because I don't, I don't claim perfect solo like that, you know? And I remember he talked about like how it was weird. I don't know. This might be a, a side tangent where he talked about how he thinks it's weird how we're reacting to the point where we don't like the, the cheaters on the leaderboards. Like, I think it was a really off-putting connection to it and like a, a not so a, a kind of an unnecessary talking point for him to bring up on his on his end like I don't know I, I, I just didn't see it as why how does that even connect to the conversation regarding like how mode perfect so like I guess it like maybe he, he could be connecting it where like you know speed runs are like a project in, in and of itself or whatever but it's not necessarily the case, you know, like they're not putting in the time or the effort in terms of like execution, you know, they can just freeze the time and play as sloppy as they want to, you know, Yeah. and like still get a good time without like solid gameplay, without disconnecting, you know, to make their time faster or whatever. I mean, I don't know. <sighs> It's it's yeah, hard to see. I'm just gonna put out this comment. Yeah, go for it, bro. Like, I, I don't know. Like, I did say to him, like, to kind of sympathize with him. Like, I I told him, like, like, I I said I'm happy for AFN. I told him I I told I told him this. I'll I'll be transparent with you, bro. Just because you're you're like mm-hmm. you're like a brother to me, bro. Like you're I I call you like my little brother. I told I told Dread, yeah, for sure. Well, but I told Dread like, hey, I'm happy AFN got it. And then I said, this is my first message to him because he asked me like, what are my thoughts about your run or whatever, right? And then I told him like, I told him I'm happy for you. And I and then I said I'm a little, I guess I guess I'm a little not not guess. I said I'm a little bummed that uh, Dredd, uh, he may have swept you under the rug, per se or whatever. Like I I, I said that to him to kind of just give him sympathy, you know, but. After talking to you now, Knight, about everything, it's like, wait, hold on a minute. Like, give me, get, let me get some context and like, fr- from your from your perspective at least, you know, like, people at least just need to hear perspectives on both sides, you know, and like, as a like, I think the only th- after hearing you talk, Knight, I think the only thing that may have quote unquote swept him under the rug was just that thirteen strat. That was that was the only thing. Yeah, Th- that's about it, though. But, but everything else, you you are right from what you said from the beginning of our conversation. It's it is intuitive to like how you ran like Aoi Village Perfect Solos on that on Nightmare Survival. You know, like mm-hmm. that that's not Hunter classes. You know. Yeah. Yeah, so, just using barrels is just like the just a logical thing to do. I yeah. Don't know. Yeah. You can't really own that strategy. Like, I think I may have said in the past on Record Night that, like, Ability Kunai Kunai was something I kind of pioneered. And technically, I, I, I kind of did, but if, any, if, if anything, bro, it's also intuitive at the same time. Like, I'm not going to claim the strat. Even though I may have done it, like, no, I, I've, you know, we've done it in the early days of when that patch did drop. But I'm not going to call that the Joey build. You know, like, like you said, like it's similar to the, like the barrel strat. It's intuitive, you know. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, I do it a lot, obviously. Like cause... you popularized it. Like nobody, nobody used to use that before you started using it. It's the same way with the samurai. Once I started playing it, I posted a video. Every started playing it. Mm-hmm. So we're we're pioneers, you know? bro. We're pioneers of that of, the, of those you, of those said strats. Obviously, we're not gonna we're not gonna take that and claim it as our own. And then, so now basically, when if every if anybody else uses it, they have to give us credit or else. Right. It's we're, like yeah, exactly. We're, I'm not gonna say to like someone who's using my strategy, "Hey, give me credit in the or whatever," you know. 
it's kind of it, it low-key reminds okay this is the dumbest analogy but like it's literally <laughs> it's like taylor swift trying to be putting her credit on olivia rodrigo i don't know if you know about the that whole debacle bro but like because like there were times um, like olivia rodrigo sounded like taylor swift and then she wanted the credit. Oh, okay she wanted the yeah, credit yeah. type of thing i know it's kind of a dumb analogy but that's just the kind of the first thing that comes to my mind as we're kind of you know dialoguing right now bro i don't know bro i i just <sighs> we can go back and forth on everything all we want on ter- in terms of like you know the, the builds and the strats because I, I i'm pretty sure that dread has his own say on certain things regarding the matter at hand you know i'm pretty sure he has yeah. his, his, his own arguments and and whatnot but I, i'm pretty sure we're clear on where we stand on it like we don't claim anything like if anyone would have gotten perfect solo hell mode before me like if undamaged seven got it before i did like if there's if we live in a world like where he undamaged got it first and i didn't get it first even though i've been like even though i am the pioneer of like perfect soloing like that's totally fine all power to undamaged he 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 would have gotten worlds first if he if he did get it you know or nightmare yeah. if you got it first before then before i did like all power to you bro i would congratulate you and of course i would feel bummed too that i didn't get it first like yeah but it's just like just good sportsmanship like even exactly. if it sucks like you just okay he got it like just respect to you mm-hmm. i i just think it's kind of like uh i don't know like i w- i guess I, I don't want the video to like because I'm, I'm almost at a 30 minute mark here I, I, like i'm at 27 minutes going into this recording like I said earlier, like, Dread may be taking this out of proportion, and I I guess I kind of stand by it. Like, it, it sucks, because yeah. you did use a different build. You did. And... Yeah, the one thing I should have said was um, the strategy on 13. 13. 13 is the, the, the one thing that you would definitely give him credit for yeah i'll admit to that yeah Yeah. and and that's fine you know we we have our own faults we have our own like i guess like Mm -hmm. yeah we have our own faults we have our own shortcomings in in that and dread i i guess speaking with you directly if you were if you are going to listen to this like i know this is like longer than in your video per se but like we we give you, we we see you, we recognize you and we understand like where you're coming from but and if if you really are closing us off from from your like circle of people to talk to and peers like that's fine i mean i had a great time playing with you if you, if if that's the case like if we're not going to play with each other anymore i i i i i get where you're coming from and i'll miss playing with you like I'm still going to be playing this game in the long run. Like, if Ghost of Tsushima 2 is not as good as the first one, bro, I'm going to... I'm going to literally look at this game like Super Smash Bros. Melee. Like, cause, because the thing is, look at it this way. Like, Super Smash Bros. Melee was, like, the happiest accident like that ever came around. I still play Melee every now and then with my, my, my actual little brother. Like, I still have sessions with him. And I still bond with him over it. Like... I don't even play the new Smash Ultimate at all. I, I, I downloaded it once. I didn't enjoy the game. Like, if that's going to be the same case for the sequel of Ghost of Tsushima, and I'm still going to be around for the first one, so be it. Like, I might not I might not even like the sequel. Like, sometimes sequels flop. Like, Smash Brothers Melee going into Smash Brothers Brawl. Brawl flopped as a competitive uh, fighting game. Uh, Smash 4 it's it's gone completely because now we have smash ultimate and then now that now that smash ultimate is around like it seems like sakurai the the creator of smash brothers he's not gonna make another game maybe maybe not like look at look at smash ultimate and its roster it's huge like who knows if in the future like sakurai might not be around anymore to make the next smash brothers 
you know but that's why i see like i'm saying like legends is probably gonna be like my smash brothers melee it's a staple game in my repertoire of games that i play because i only play a select few games and legends is probably gonna be with me in the long haul maybe until like i don't know if this if, if only if the sequel isn't as good as as it is right now um but I was addressing dread, dreadbound. I, I'm I'm gonna miss playing with you, bro. If if we're not gonna play anymore, or if you if you're really disassoci dissociating yourself with myself and a fun nightmare. Um. I don't know. Like, if if you're gonna hold on to this said grudge, and if if you don't want to make amends, so be it. I I we 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 tried to, to reach out. Um, you made you made a video, and I guess this is kind of sort of our response to your video and and our side of the story at least. So yeah, there's there's not there's no hard feelings towards dread from our end at all. It's just we just want to at least like acknowledge our position on these matters. Yeah. Sorry, sorry, night. I kind of. Went off on a longer tangent. No, you're right? good, bro. You're good. Do what you gotta say. We got nothing but respect for you, though, Dread. Like, bro, nothing but like this guy has done like his undamaged runs. You don't see anybody else going for that. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Nobody else. It was absolutely. And like, he's incredible for that. You know, like. Yeah, but, like nothing but respect for that. Like exactly. nobody else was like really pushing the envelope in this game you know like doing things that like nobody has really done before right. at least for the couple months that like i was away mm -hmm. i didn't really see anybody like doing you know just ambitious and like crazy runs but yeah. then this guy is like doing a bunch of undamaged duos on freaking twilight blood and steel like you got, you just gotta respect it, bro. Nobody's nobody's out here even imagining or thinking that they could do that. Exactly, bro. But he does it, so. What? Oh, dude, there was something on Facebook on the Facebook Legends page that was posted, that was very ambiguous. Um. One of the commenters on. Um, on um oh, it's okay like i, I don't know because it's it's ambiguous like it, it could be towards you and me or something i'm not sure mm -hmm. i'm really not sure maybe maybe, maybe it's not i, I don't want to take this post out of proportion because i did see her comment on dreadbound's video like um she made a post on the facebook legends page where like people are like backstabbing each other or something like that or or like taking your ideas and it, it's it seems like it's geared towards you and me a fun nightmare and it's like i don't know it's just if it is this is our response altogether and if it isn't yeah isn't, like but i just don't see how you're to blame like okay for me you could say that i should have uh, for 13 i definitely should have given him credit mm -hmm. for that yeah exactly but um like bro what did you do you didn't do anything. Like he sent you your runs, but you did nothing with them. Yeah, I I did you nothing yourself, with his have, link. I I, I didn't, bro. I didn't I didn't copy anything. I never grinded for it. I yeah, I, I didn't you even never tell. Sent it to me. You didn't like. I yeah. I didn't send like, it to bro, you. I didn't do anything to backstab like, him at all. You did nothing. You did nothing wrong, bro. Bro, I'm, I'm gonna say this. You did bro. nothing. Wrong. The only exactly. thing I guess like what what he he expected you to like. Um, show you out in my video. The thing is, it's like which is just I don't. It's contentious. Like you could say whether that was right or wrong. I don't. But besides that, bro, like you on your end, there was nothing wrong. I don't see anything that you did wrong. Yeah, bro. I it's 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 weird because like I uh, oh, sorry, my my thoughts left my. Head. I did say earlier, but like my 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 my. I was away from the mic from mm -hmm. earlier. Um, 
I guess I can. Oh, I totally forgot what I was gonna say. I don't want to. I don't want to like. Just repeat what we're saying over and over for this recording. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, that's our side of the story. I'm gonna end. The, I'm gonna end this recording in particular. I think it was just good to kind of document our conversation at least because. I don't know if I want to explain myself again and again and again. Like. Oh, I, I think I remember what I was going to say now. Like, yeah, he sent me his videos. I, Some of them, I, I watched parts of it. And then there were some I didn't even watch at all. Like, and I never, yeah, I never sent it to you. I didn't send it to anybody else. Like, like I, I didn't try to, like, discredit him for anything. Like, that's just... Coming from my from my perspective, at least, you know. Okay, I'm gonna end this recording. I, I I have no bad blood towards anyone in the community, and I've always been that way. You know, like <laughs> I have nothing against anybody. I mean, there are times where I ignore people, <laughs> but it's just out of my own discretion because there are times like I just want to be. You know, I want to come home from a busy day of school and just kind of do my own thing with, who, like, my own, like, friends and circle of people, you know? Like, sometimes I don't always want to talk to, like, someone random. Or, I don't know, like, sometimes I'll, j I'll just solo a little bit. Or I, sometimes I don't even play the game because I'm so busy with school, you know? Anyway, yeah. it kind of sucks that this kind of had to come up like literally days before you have to go back to school, bro. I'm I'm sorry this had to come up, nightmare. No, no, it's all good. It, it, it's just kind of. It's just a weird situation. Yeah, we're caught in it. I'm pretty sure like people are just. You don't deserve to be in this for like at all. I know, bro. Like this is. I'm, uh... We're I'm done with school, and I'm about to go into internship, and like you're about to go back to Barbados to you know continue your studies yeah. to become a doctor, and it's like. You know, we have we're real people with real lives, and at the same time, it's like no, like this is all should be pretty minor, like in the grand scheme of things. Like yeah, you know, we there's much more important things to focus on, of course, but mm -hmm. just to like kind of address it and give our side of things. Yeah, ultimately, you know, and that's kind of just where my recording is, and I guess I'll end it here. Cause I don't want to. I feel like we said everything we needed to say. Unless you got more to say, Knight. Nah, no. I think we said what had to okay. be said. And yeah, like I guess the last thing I I, I just want to say is, Dread. I hope we're still friends. And if we're not, like, I I just hope like we can still like if if there is a sequel, and if there is a multiplayer. I, I just hope we can still connect, man. Like, you, you, you are still a, an amazing player. And if you're disappointed in me for not giving you credit for something, uh, like like the 13 strat, I'm sorry about that. I, I'm, I'm sorry for not calling out Nightmare, but I, 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 I heard his context of everything. And so, yeah, that's, that's kind of about everything I'm about to say. Okay. Nightmare is AFK. I, I, I really didn't want to have to make a video, but oh my gosh, here it is. Uncut, unscripted, and yeah, that's about it. I hope people are still going to enter the tournament tomorrow. So, all right. Thank you, everyone. God bless everybody. Have a good day. Have a good weekend.